Yo guys, Fetch Productions here, and today we'll be on. Yo guys, Fetch Productions here. Today I'll be showing you my Colt M4A1 uh, review. Um, to start off, guys, this bad thing goes 430 FPS. Um, bought at Dick's Sporting Goods for $140. Um, start from the back to the front. Um, back has the adjustable stock, of course. Um, you guys want short, there you go, it just clicks right into place. And I prefer it to be, you know, longer, just like that, so I'm on the field, you know. See the scope better. Um, yeah. Um, grip, inside the grip here, guys, is where the motor is actually located. So all you have to do to get to the motor is unscrew this piece right here, and the grip slides right off, just in case you need to replace your motor. Um, trigger action very um, effective um, right here guys we have the semi we have the auto we have the safe um, like I said it shoots up to 430 FPS guys um, then up top here we have the Tacticon Armament zoom scope I have a review on this zoom scope um, go check that out guys if you want to know more about it um, to actually flip the side guys very nice um, so if I want to see long distance flip it in short distance flip it out um, right up here is my red slash green dot um, bought this at Amazon for about twenty dollars um, very cheap but I, I mean very accurate I mean um, you have to scope it in of course at first um, but once you scope it in, it just works great. So, um, yeah, um, right down here is the property of U.S. government um, stamp. Guys, this stamp is actually um, rare on a lot of guns. It's very cool to have this on this gun. I really like it. Um, but, yeah, I think it's a cool feature. Um, right here is the mag. This mag is actually a Lancer Tactical Bought Mag, um, Scroll Mag. The reason I like the Scroll Mags, guys, is because when I'm, whenever I'm on the field, you know, if I run out, just scroll it up, boom, it's ready to go. So, yeah, and um, railing system is, um, you get two rails uh, that slide off, just in case you want to mount like a flashlight onto there. Um, real easy just to slide these off. Um, all you need to do is press this in right here and it'll just slide right off for you guys um, I have them on right now with tape because mine started to um, break away because I was screwing around with it too much um, up here is my GoPro mount um, GoPro slides right onto this mount right here and screwed it right around the barrel here um, that ain't moving very secure bought that about for about $40 at Walmart, um, very front is my homemade suppressor, um, full steel guys. Um, of course, it doesn't really act as a suppressor though because suppressors never really work on airsoft guns because all the sound comes from the motor inside here itself, and you can't really silence that. So I just have that on for style because I hate seeing this orange tip. Um, you guys, um, that is the review of the gun itself. Like I said, bought at Dick's Sporting Goods. Um, $140, great price, guys. I've been using it for a year and a half now. Um, still works great. Um, not heavy at all. Um, when you take this in the field, guys, it's actually very light. Um, it is full steel, though, guys. Arrow is full steel. You know. Whole body is full steel. Um, I'm really liking it, guys. Um, the only thing I had, though, guys, was some. Sometimes when I'm in the field, it's now been acting up with the motor um, since I've been using it a bit too much. Um, the motor's been acting up, so when I use semi, sometimes it just doesn't fire. So I just have to switch to auto, back to semi, and it works again fine. So just something to keep in mind, guys. Um, but like I've said, I've been using it for a year and a half, so. It's basically typical for most guns. 
Um, but yeah, well, let's get to shooting it. Before I forget, guys, um, the battery compartment is right in here, so you just have to click these two buttons together, this one and the one on the other side. Click it together. This comes off, and it's a dual battery, guys, that it takes. Um, slides right on out, fits right on in there. Now let's get to the shooting. facing and we're out guys so that is the final product of our video um, thanks for watching make sure to tap the subscription button right here um, last video and a random video. Um, thanks for watching, guys. Hope you enjoyed it. Um, this gun was a great buy. Um, get yourself one. See you next time.